All right, y'all, I'm gonna put some chicken breast right on in my crock pot here. All right, go ahead. Uh, I use like three to four, two to four, however many y'all want, okay? Um, just right in your crock pot, and today I'm using my crock pot liner. All right, next, we're gonna put one packet of taco seasoning right on top of our chicken, all right? So we're just gonna spread it however we want. It's all gonna melt together while it's cooking, so that's just fine. Um, we also add in a little bit of Himalayan pink salt, and then I like to add some extra pepper. This is one of my favorite easy dinners. Everyone in my family loves it, including Kevin the cat. I'm just kidding, y'all. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. All right, next, we're gonna add one jar, uh, I don't even know, 15 ounces of uh, salsa. Y'all wanna use mild, medium, hot, whatever you want. We're just pouring this right on top of our chicken and our taco seasoning, all right? All right, y'all, next, we have uh, one can of this uh, corn. All right, so um, we leaving the juice in. Leave the juice. It's very important with this taco seasoning. You need some liquid, so that's the liquid we're using, all right? And then we have one can of diced chilies. I use the medium, all right, but y'all can use whatever you want. Right on top. All right, y'all. Uh, so now we're gonna give it a little mixy mixy. Y'all know, right? Uh, I'm trying to find, how about, how about this, this spatula, because it matches my shirt. And you know what my shirt says? Love you. It should say love y'all. I should make my own, but I love y'all. I love y'all. I love y'all. Even the glove police. Uh, sometimes. All right. So we're just, uh, we're just gonna give this a little mixy mixy, kinda. We, we, we're not really mixing anything. We're just like pushing it down. But that's it, y'all. All right. So we're gonna let this sit on low about three to four hours. We have one more thing to add, y'all. But this is my favorite easy way to make delicious chicken tacos. All right, y'all. So this has been cooking in my crock pot for like. Uh, like three and a half hours or so, something like that. All right, so now uh, we gotta shred the chicken. All right, so we gonna, we gonna, oh, okay. Maybe I should use a fork. Why, why am I using these, Fred? What's wrong with me? I need a fork. I found one, okay. Wow. The struggle is real, Fred. What's going on? What, what is it? Oh, this is shredding, per okay, y'all, this is great. All right, I'm just kidding. Everything's great, life is great. So our next step, we gonna take one jar of Salsa con queso, mild. I like this Taco Bell kind, it's real good. We're gonna dump this right on in our crock pot. Right on in. Let me see, I gotta get it all out. We need all this goodness, okay, y'all? Get it all out. All right, that's it. Yeah, okay. I, I, I wanna lick this jar, y'all. I'm, I'm not even gonna lie. I'm gonna try this cheese, actually. I ain't gonna lie, let's see. That is so good. Fred, this is, Fred was just like, you're using Taco Bell cheese? I thought he was gonna be mad. He's like, it's gonna be real good. Fred, it's delicious. I know. He was right. All right, we're gonna give this a little stir. Little stir, 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 stir. All right, so y'all, now that it's cooked, if y'all want, wanna let it sit on warm or just uh, room temperature for a little bit, it'll thicken up. But uh, I don't wanna do that, cause I'm hungry. So guess what, time to eat. Okay, y'all, so here's a few things y'all can do with this. Y'all wanna serve it? Uh, as like a soup? I, maybe you can. I don't know. That's not my intention though, so I don't even know why I'm saying that. I have a tortilla. Now I'm going to take some of this cheesy chicken mixture. Remember, we have corn in here, some jalapenos. No, we didn't put any jalapenos. Okay, I'm just going to stop talking. We have corn, salsa. Remember, we put salsa in here, and uh, what else did we put in here, Fred? Some other stuff. Okay, that's great. Okay, a little more chicken. Ooh, this sauce, y'all. I'm excited. This is going to be so good. All right. So that's what we're gonna do. And then I have some veggies here. So let's see, I'm gonna put uh, some black olives. I have some green pepper, I have some tomatoes. I just have a hodgepodge of veggies here. So that's what we're putting in here, all right? That looks great, just like that. And we also gonna put a little sour cream. A Little bit, just a little bit. Okay, now we're gonna roll this up like a burrito. Do I know how to do a burrito? I'm, I'm gonna figure it out. Oh, right, I'm doing it right. I'm doing it right, Fred. Oh my goodness, it's, it's like that, that's it. I feel like, I feel like that ain't right. They do something else though, how do they do it at Chipotle? That's what I'm trying to do. Okay y'all, it's time to, time to eat. Uh, it's gonna be real hot, I'm gonna get some of that juice out. But uh, yeah y'all, this is the best way to make homemade chicken tacos or burritos or burrito bowls, whatever you want. This chicken mixture is gonna be so good. So I'm gonna take a little bite because it's gonna be hot. I should have got Kevin too. Anyways, here we go. Mmm, 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 no. Oh my goodness, Fred, you was right. 
Y'all, I'm, I'm not gonna lie, it's my first time using the Taco Bell cheese. Uh, it's delicious. Y'all should try it.